Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I imagine if you're a Jehovah Witness, you're probably so angry at me right now, you could uh, shoot me for blaspheming your website saying that it's Satan's website. <laughs> Let me explain something, Jehovah Witnesses. I was in your religion. I used to believe this was God's organization and there was no lies, absolutely no lies in this organization till I was challenged to ask a question to the elders. And when I saw their reaction, I knew I had to go to find out the real truth. And that's the reason I type in EX Jehovah Witnesses. Because when you take scriptures from the Bible and can prove Jehovah Witnesses teaching is wrong, then it must be something wrong with the religion. Must be. Because when you say God's word is a lie, Christ's words is a lie, and say your religion or any religion is teaching the truth, but the Bible's not, then you have a problem. You believe the governed body, you believe the watchtower, but you don't believe in the Bible. That is like Satan have twisted the minds of many people in the world. Many cults, many false religion. All of them says, I am the truth, I am the way. Doesn't that sound like the watchtower saying the same thing? We are the truth. And our truth will get you in paradise. But that's not what the Bible says. The Bible teaches that we come to Christ. Christ is the path of eternal life. Not Jehovah. Because God gave all authority, all authority and power to correct this world, destroy all religion, and to give eternal life to anyone that who deserves this. That is Christ's job, not God's or no, not your God, Jehovah. Now, I want to show you something that someone left me a message, that I left someone else a message, and then we continue. Sorry about that. Jerry Jones, all that stuff is true. So the information I showed him about Jehovah Witnesses, he agreed is true. True. But saying that their website is the devil's website sounds a little crazy. Yes, it does sound a little crazy. But it's the truth. If you're teaching that you taught your members in the past and people find out the truth that you've been lying to many people from day one from Charles T. Russell's teaching all the way up to to um, today's or this new year 2016 
means that your website and the Bible students website and other religions websites is deceiving you and that means when you're deceiving someone feeding good information but they don't see the flaws they're hiding and sometimes it's in plain sight but you overread it read it but you don't understand it just like Satan deceived Christ and Eve oh your eyes will be open you will know good and bad you'll be like God half truth but where's the lie you won't die God knows when your eyes you eat from the tree your eyes will be open their eyes was already open there was a walking around with a cane and 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 was it be able to see their eyes was open Eve was deceived and she deceived her husband Christ was the next challenge to to be deceived but Satan fell Christ knew that you must obey God if Adam and Eve listened to God's words not to a snake they would have be here today so God's word is truth and life Christ's words is truth and light so why I say this is Satan's website is to lure you there and to see Everything you can imagine is wrong with your family, uh, your world, and things that bothers you the most, too much stress and all that. Heck, any religion, false religion, can come up with, with um, words that's soothing, that would open your mind and heart and say, hmm, this sounds good, hmm, this is what I feel. They see exactly what's wrong with me. Of course. You think they're going to put it out in plain sight that saying that this website is designed to fool you and to mislead you so you can come into our organization that is actually main purpose to deceive you so you won't get eternal life from God or Christ. People, that's the reason why we do research. I studied the Mormon's religion. Joseph Smith is nothing but a fraud and a liar. And the other religions I studied, they are the same thing. And their websites, it's just like Satan the devil deceiving you. Jehovah Witch says, your website is to lure you in. Any innocent person that turned their back on the Bible and listen to Watchtower's teaching and listen to you who go to their door and the lies you learn from the Watchtower, you're teaching them to turn their back on Christ to serve a false god named Jehovah. That is your purpose when you go door to door. That makes you 
blood guilty makes you to to destroy people's families if they don't agree with Watchtower's teaching and you convince that purpose that uh, this is persecution persecution so you need to listen to God's word not your family sorry about the noise but we do have a shooting range out here people it's time to wake up if Jehovah Witnesses call everybody's website and the churches part of Satan's organization. Think about this for a second. Wouldn't that make them the same when we found so many lies? When they say we protect our children? We protect our children in the kingdom hall. They are safe with our elders, safe with our minister servants, our brothers. They are safe. Well, I challenge you. I challenge you with your life, with your life right now, to see if I'm lying or not. Then you can. Come back and tell me what you watch on Jake, J-A-K-K-E, Control, on YouTube, that there was no deception, or in this case, you lied, and there was deceptions, that wasn't Jeffrey Jackson, those was not true Jehovah Witnesses elders in Australia court and they were saying they protect the children and what I'm saying is a lie about they was hiding the truth from the police to the congregations about these child molesters in the kingdom hall I will shut down my YouTube channel and I will apologize to all Jehovah Witnesses and I'll go back to the kingdom hall and be a good little slave a good little robot so I challenge you go to that channel I'll shut my YouTube channel. But I'm going to tell you something. You think the truth on these videos and about Jeffrey Jackson is a lie? Watch them on JW Broadcast. This is the same man. Same words. There's no way apostates or ex Jehovah Witnesses could <laughs> conduct <laughs> find anyone that looked like him or speak like him. And here's the thing. Christ said in the last, last days, don't worry about what comes out of your mouth to the authorities. What comes out will be the truth. Well, guess what? He made a fool out of himself. He couldn't answer straight questions. He beat around the bush. And they won't change the two witness rule. That you need two witnesses. To see someone raping a child, your child? Shut my YouTube channel. If you can, watch that videos, those videos, then tell me.